Hey guys, hey, welcome to our intro to essential oils class. I am so excited that you guys are here. And Whitney, thank you so much for creating this time and space with your tribe that we can come in and educate. It is such a pleasure to be here with you. Yes. Um, hi, everyone, and welcome. Thanks for joining Dr. Laura Ritchie and I to teach you some basic information about essential oils. I actually met Dr. Laura on Facebook. I reached out to her at the beginning of this year because I was having lots of fatigue and energy issues. And she was very knowledgeable and I've learned so much from her and I'm so glad to be joining her to teach this class. Oh, thanks so much. And we've got Michelle watching on Zoom. We've got Sandra watching over on Facebook. So hi, ladies. Thank you guys so much for joining us. And if you have any questions as we go through, oh, Terry's joining us too, then please type in the comments and let us know. We would love to help and serve. Yes. So a little bit about my backstory. I actually started using essential oils in 2014 for some physical back pain that I had been having. Um, a family friend introduced me to Deep Blue Rub, and it mm -hmm. was the only thing that um, really helped my pain at the time. And then this year, I have really started using them more. After I reached out to Laura and kind of got back in the groove with the oils again, I'm now using them in my everyday practice, and I've noticed just such a big difference, especially with my sleep and energy, and um, my stress level has gone way down since really starting and incorporating them into my daily living. Oh, that's huge. What a blessing because <laughs> yes. discomfort, any of that's no fun and stress is so important for us. Right. Yeah. Well, Whitney, will you kick us off and talk to us a little bit about what essential oils are for those that are new? Yes. So essential oils are pure liquid extracts that are steam released or pressed from plants. So they come from like the seeds, the stems, the flowers, and the bark of trees and plants. They have been used for centuries and they're even mentioned in the Bible. They have therapeutic properties that support wellness and many other concerns, such as improving your mood, rejuvenating your skin, cooking, cleaning, and overall wellness. They are 100% plant derived with no other processing or ingredients. Awesome. I love that. And essential oils now are becoming kind of a buzzword. We're seeing them just about everywhere. So it's really important that we talk about the quality. Oh, Helen joined us. Hi, Helen. Thanks for joining us. And this is so cool because I feel like this gives us natural solutions and natural tools and remedies to help support people. So I'm going to dive in and talk a little bit about why quality matters because there's a lot of fake oils out there and we're going to help you pinpoint what to look for, how to avoid the fake oils, because what we're talking about is really a pure therapeutic grade oil. And there is a big difference just like with our supplements or with our food. So I'm going to share my screen real quick through the power of technology <laughs> and show you guys a little bit more. We're going to dive deeper into this and being able to identify a fake oil versus a pure therapeutic grade oil with this. Oh, hi, Jerry. Jerry joining us as well. It's great to see you guys all pop on. So this is a big difference, and I point this out because you are going to find essential oils at the health food store, at maybe the mall, at this was from Kohl's. <laughs> They're all over the place, and it's very different. Now, unfortunately, there is no governing agency that's regulating the quality and the purity of an essential oil, so they can really say anything that they want <laughs> on the packaging, unfortunately, and nobody is double checking this. So this bottle of oil, the box that you can see right here, it actually says 100% pure and natural essential oil. And then it says it's going to do all these awesome things. It's going to help you in all these awesome ways. And then it comes from Germany. Well, here's a big difference. When you flip the bottle over or this box, we want to start asking questions. And one big one when you're looking at the quality and safety of an oil is, is it safe for internal use. And this one is not. You will actually see there's a lot of warning signs here on the box. It actually says that it's flammable, that it causes skin irritation, eye damage, allergic skin reaction, fatal if swallowed, very toxic, keep out of reach of children and pets, and not to ingest or use during pregnancy. And these are all big warning signs that the essential oil is not 
pure. This is a fake, fake oil, especially something that has orange and lemon. And these are things that we recognize as food. And if we can't take that internally, uh, that's a little worrisome. Also, it's saying don't put it on your skin. It causes skin irritation. So whatever we put on our skin is actually absorbed transdermally into our bloodstream. We don't, it's not a raincoat. <laughs> it goes in. So that really makes me concerned. A little bit and this is the big difference and why I think it's so important to talk about these things and be aware as consumers so one important thing to look for on a bottle of oil when you're looking at quality and purity is actually if it is safe for internal use and if it has a supplement fact right there on the label so if you're not seeing this that's something to check out if it's something especially like orange or lemon or peppermint or lavender things that we recognize as food and it's saying for aromatic use only or do not put on the skin or do not take internally. That is a fake synthetic fragrance or artificial fragrance, not a therapeutic grade oil. And just put it back on the shelf and run away because <laughs> that is going to be a waste for your money. That's more of an, a synthetic fragrance, a frou-frou kind of smell good thing versus something that is actually a therapeutic grade oil oil with that. So that's something that's really, really important. And I just wanted to share with you guys. And then another thing that is also important that we can kind of talk about too, is with this looking at what is the transparency? Where does this oil come from? Can you actually check the testing of this oil? So there's a really amazing website that I wanted to point you to because I think it's really important to have resources and tools, right? So this is Share Oils, or not Share Oils, Source to You, Source to You.com. And this is a really great tool and resource. So if you're like me, I'm nerdy. My background is I'm a physical therapist. And you can learn more about the growers, the distillers, the scientists, and the research that's done on these oils, the practitioners. doTERRA is actually partnered with healthcare practitioners and facilities and hospitals, and tons of great information. But what I'm going to focus on for this is actually coming up here to the quality reports. Because an oil is only as good as its chemistry. So on the bottle of oil, on all the different bottles of oil from doTERRA here, you can see a stamp and there's a code, there's a number there. You can actually type that in and you will see your specific results, the testing results for your batch of oil, which is really incredible. I don't know anyone else that is doing this, any other company. So full transparency with what's going on with these oils. So this is tested by a third party lab, Aromatic Plant Research Center. This is my bottle of frankincense right here in my hand. And you can scroll down and you can see the chromat chromatogram, all of the testing that's done. Cause again, an oil is only as good as its chemistry. So you can see the different compound names, all of the results for the testing. And then at the bottom here, it actually says this analysis of frankincense is revealed to have no contaminants or adulteration, which is huge. So I love that full transparency. I love that we get to see that for our specific bottle of oil. That's really, really important and really amazing to have on hand. And it's, it's a big difference, right? We want to make sure, especially when we're using these in our home, internally in our children, like using it with them, that this is a really safe pharmaceutically active therapeutic grade oil that we're talking about that we're using with this. So that's another really great tool and research to use because quality really does matter. The other big difference is doTERRA works right with the growers, right with the farmers, and the plant material is derived from where these plants thrive. So as an example, lavender comes from, from France, lemon comes from Italy, Frankincense comes from Somalia, really where these plants are designed to thrive because everything we know, any good gardener will know that the soil, the weather, the humidity, even the time of day that these plants are harvested has an effect on that chemical constituent and on the purity and how well those oils are looking and growing and we're going to respond. So we want purity, we want potency, and we want to be getting consistent results every time we use these oils. So that's really, really important because I feel like I'm not doing my due diligence diligence if I'm just explaining oils and how to use them because not all oils are created equally. So we want to keep you and your family safe and that's why it's really important. And then I'm briefly going to talk about three different ways to use our essential oils. So we have aromatic, 
topical and internal, and then we'll go into the top 10 oils and a little bit of how you can use them to support different things. So the first is aromatic, and that is going to be the best for respiratory or emotional support. So it can be something as simple as taking a drop of your lavender essential oil and just smelling it right out of the bottle. You can just inhale, and then one of my favorite things to do is a palm inhale, where I'll show you, we'll put a drop of oil in my hand, and then just rub it together. That kind of heats up the oil. We cup over nose and mouth, and we do a deep inhale. And this is a great way to support yourself, again, respiratory or emotional support and just change your mood. And what's so amazing about inhaling essential oils, not the synthetic kind, synthetic fragrances actually are harmful to our endocrine system and our hormones and our lungs and things, but with a pure therapeutic grade oil, you're actually, when you inhale, it goes into the olfactory system, into the limbic system of the brain, which houses all of our memories. And that's why we can smell something and it may take us back to a memory or remind you of your grandmother or a different time in life. So that is really cool, very powerful. And it's a direct link into your central nervous system. So we know stress is a big issue for a lot of people. This is a great way to calm down and really help support us and support our central nervous system. The only other thing that does that, interestingly enough, is music. So I love to combine maybe soothing music with the essential oils. It's a really beautiful thing to do for your health and wellness and get rid of the plugins and the room sprays and all of that stuff that can actually cause us to gain weight have lots of issues. You can actually Google synthetic fragrance is the new secondhand smoke. And there's some really interesting articles from the Huffington Post. If you're like me and like the research and like to dive deeper into this, really interesting stuff. The other thing that we can do is actually diffuse an essential oil. So here I actually have a diffuser right next to me. So I'll show you guys how simple it is to do this. But this is a little diffuser. I have some water in here. There's a little fill line. So you can actually just take your essential oil, add two or three drops in there. I'm going to do three drops of peppermint and three drops of lemon. And this is one of my favorite things to diffuse to help with focus, with energy, with getting up in the morning. The mints are energizing and the citrus oils are happy oils. They actually help to boost our mood. And then we just turn it on. And it's super simple and not sure if you guys can see this, but you can see how the it really helps to just get those volatile, those aromatic compounds into the air. Diffusing actually helps to cleanse and purify the air. So it's a great, great option that you can do. You can diffuse at nighttime to help you sleep. You can diffuse in the morning to help you get up or help with focus or anything like that. So we love to diffuse in our home and you guys can see how simple that is. It doesn't take any time at all and it's a great upgrade to the synthetic fragrances, the chemicals, things that you clean with, any of those things that's actually giving you benefit both physically and emotionally with that because when we diffuse or when we inhale an oil, it's actually reaching the brain within 22 seconds, which is really powerful. So again, when we're talking about our neuroanatomy, we're talking about our brain, we want to make sure that things that we're using are really pure and really safe. Next is topical. Topical is put it where it hurts. Very simple. So the essential oils are actually really safe. You can apply them topically. So for example, like when we put our lavender on, when you add an essential oil and you put it on topically, within about two minutes, it's seen in the bloodstream. Within about 22 minutes, it can be seen in every cell. So the oils, it is an oil, it's a lipid, and lipids can actually go into the cell membrane, which is really powerful and cool. So again, this is why purity matters, right? Why we, when we're putting something on our skin, it's going to go into our bloodstream. That's very important. So we use a carrier oil, something like fractionated coconut oil, olive oil, almond oil, jojoba oil, whatever that looks like. And I like to always dilute oils. So we actually teach our oilers, how to make roller bottles and dilute oils where you may put five to 10 drops of an oil in a roller and then it's already diluted with this fractionated coconut oil and that carrier oil just carries it right into the skin. So when you use a carrier oil, you get maximum absorption. Almost all of that goes into the skin versus if you just put an oil on by itself, about half of that's gonna be evaporated. So I love encouraging everybody to always dilute you can really apply it anywhere, put it where it hurts with the exception of we never want to put oils in the eyes or in the ears. That's a no-no, but everywhere else, go for it. 
Also, because this happens, some people, sometimes we may put peppermint on and forget to wash our hands and touch near our eye. If anything is ever uncomfortable, always just add more carrier oil. If you have something going on with the eye, we don't want to flush with water because water and oil does not mix, but put that carrier oil on and go around the eye and that will draw it out and it works really, really nicely for you. And then last but not least is internal use. So internal use, again, only if you're seeing a supplement fact on that bottle of oil. That's really important. If you don't see a supplement fact on your bottle of oil, that's an adulterated synthetic fragrance and we do not want to take it internally. But that's a really powerful thing because as an example, one drop of peppermint oil is equivalent to about 28 cups of peppermint tea. And maybe you're needing some digestive support, maybe you have an upset tummy, you can do a little drop in water and take that, maybe really hard to drink 28 cups of peppermint tea, but you can quickly take a drop of peppermint and soothe and get some support really quickly. So internal use is going to be the best to help with healthy immune function, respiratory function, or even cooking with our oils. So I love to put a drop of peppermint in brownies or cookies or a drop of wild orange in water. The only thing that you want to be aware of is when we're taking essential oils internally, just make sure that we're doing that from a glass or stainless steel cup, never plastic. Plastic, the oils actually break down the petrochemicals in the plastic, and we don't want that in our life. Also, plastic has some endocrine disruptors, BPA, and different things that can affect our hormones and our fertility. So that's just a good safety tip in general to avoid the plastics when we can. And then really quickly, I'm going to share my screen with you guys again because I forgot to share this with you. And this is a question that comes up so you guys can screenshot this or have this on hand. This is a dilution guide based off of age that you can use. So sometimes people have questions, how much should we dilute? This is a really nice tool and it's a recommendation, it's a guide. So for little babies, we may start with one drop in a 10 ml roller and then top with your carrier oil. But if you're not getting the results, you can always go up. So I like to start less is more. You can always add more and open it up. It's harder to take away and start there. And this is just a good guideline for adults, about five to 10 drops. And then you can always go up. I like about 10 drops of my rollers. My husband likes about 20. So there's a little bit of bioindividuality and finding what works best for you. But this is a nice guide that we have and we use to support people with. Okay, let's dive in a little bit into the top 10 oils really quick and give you just a little quick tour of some of the main oils that we use a lot in our home. So first we have frankincense. Frankincense is the king of oils. It's an enhancer oil. It's known as the baby Jesus oil. We know that the Christ child was given frankincense and myrrh. This is a really awesome oil for peace and relaxation. It can help to support the skin. So if you have any scars that need support, stretch marks, blemishes, reducing those appearances of blemishes, great to really help strengthen your immune system. And frankincense is one of those power hitters. You can add it to any roller blend or things and it'll bring out those properties. So we also say when in doubt, pull Frank out. If you have no idea what essential oil to use, use your frankincense. It is such a great one to have on hand. And I use it so much actually because it supports your cardiovascular system, your nervous system, musculoskeletal system, digestive system, pretty much just about everything. So I keep a dropper top on mine to make it really convenient. Again, only with a therapeutic grade oil. And I just put a drop right under my tongue, morning and night, really simple. It makes a big difference. My mom was having some discomfort in her knees and in her joints in her hands and adding in some frankincense taking it internally using some rollers topically made such a huge difference in her quality of life and how she was feeling so that is really great great oil next we've got lavender lavender is all things calm oil calming for skin calming for mood and emotions really great helps to ease sadness helps with anxious feelings and relaxation and even sleep so bottoms of the feet are a great place to put your oils because we have some large pores there for quick absorption. So this is really nice. Also any types of aches or discomfort, maybe you have head or neck tension, muscle tension, joint aches, anything you can apply that topically too. You can layer with your frankincense. I love to combine the oils together. It's a really fun thing. You can add them together and they just enhance. They work synergistically. So you don't have to worry about getting fun and getting creative and adding and layering and making it your own which is really, really nice. 
very great to soothe any skin, occasional irritations, any redness. Maybe you're out in the sun too long, got a little red, you can put your lavender on. Maybe you were cooking, got a little too close to the stove, you can use the lavender to support you. But this is also a really, really nice one for seasonal threats. Maybe it's pollen season, maybe you have the sniffles or anything, actually a combination of lavender, lemon, and peppermint, a little bit of water internally amazing amazing for that that was a game changer for my husband all right lemon lemon's very cleansing it's really great to support your digest digestion so I actually like to do a drop in warm water in the morning and that just helps to kind of get your digestion going very nice to help detox very gently your filter organs like your liver and your kidneys Great for anything sticky. So if you've got kids, you need lemon in your life for getting gum out of your hair, removing any stickers or sticky residue or crayons or marker. <laughs> I've had so many people say, lemon saved my deposit. We got our deposit back on our apartment or whatever it was because it got rid of some sticky situations with lemon, which is really nice. Very great for cleaning surfaces. Um, because it's very cleansing, smells amazing, and we use it for a lot of things. But all the citruses are happy oils, and it just smells very fresh and clean and is a really nice one. We've got Melaleuca, very cleansing as well. So this is a, a nice one to boost your immune system. It helps with fighting off those, those pathogens, those invaders in the body. Really nice for cleaning hands and surfaces. Also for any types of cuts or scrapes. My husband actually just this morning got up into the attic. He was putting some things up in the attic and scraped and cut his leg. And so we automatically just put some Melaleuca right on there. It doesn't burn and it works very, very nicely. So I love that we have natural tools that support us when we need them. But Melaleuca is really awesome. Even for ear discomfort, it's a nice one you can use with lavender for kiddos and we don't want to go in the ear, but you can go around the ear and it works really nicely for that. Oregano. This is a spicy, spicy oil. It's a hot oil. So we want to be respectful of our oregano. This is one that you always, always want to dilute because it is a hot oil. We all have an oregano story. If you forget, I promise you're going to be okay. <laughs> Might not feel like it, but you will. And just add that carrier on and it'll soothe any of the discomfort there. But this is a powerhouse for immune support. So big gun pathogens, bugs, things that you need support with, very, very nice. It has a warming sensation, so it can feel really good for supporting and easing any aches or discomfort with joints or muscles maybe you got a scratchy throat, you could actually take it internally. We have little veggie caps that you can open up, put a drop or two of the oil, close it and take it internally since this is a hotter oil. Great as well for digestion, so many things. And then peppermint, oh, love peppermint. So the mints are very energizing, very cooling, helps with any digestive discomfort or things, helps with respiratory function. So I love to put it on my chest before I exercise, a drop on my tongue before I exercise. Great for head or neck tension. This is the oil that made my husband a believer in what oils could do because he was having some bad head tension and we just put it on topically and he said, these oils are amazing. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And really great for, basically it feels like almost putting a cold pack on your skin because it's so cooling. So anything that you need cooling, maybe it's hot outside here in West Texas, it's hot, it's August, or maybe you have a little one that has a high body temperature. This is great to really bring that down and be super, super helpful with that. Then we've got a couple blends. So the blends are where we've taken several different plants and the essential oils and blended them up for maximum benefit with that. Breathe is our respiratory blend. So all things respiratory, anything that you can think of that falls in that respiratory category, it's going to be really great. Even noisy sleepers, maybe you're a noisy sleeper or your partner, spouse, person is a noisy sleeper. This can save marriages. Breathe is awesome. So diffuse that at bedtime, put it on the bottoms of the feet, especially the big toe opens that up. So amazingly well. So again, seasonal threats, pollen season, sniffles, anything to open up that respiratory system. This is really, really powerful oil. Then we've got the soothing blend. This is our deep blue. This is all things aches and discomfort. If it hurts, use deep blue. Very, very powerful oil. So for soothing muscles, 
aches, discomfort in the joints. This is really nice, great to help you and support you. So low back discomfort, knee discomfort, head discomfort, if anywhere, you can just use your deep blue. We love, love, love this oil so much. And that was a refreshing thing with me for the oils because I was like, oh man, you mean I don't have to swallow another thing? I can just put something on where I need the support. That was so refreshing for me along my journey when I first started with oils. And we got Digestin. Digestin is the digestive blend. It is really great to be used both internally and topically over the stomach when you need it. So if you are having occasional stomach upset or you need a little bit of support, anything digestive, this is going to be a great one. Also for nauseous feelings or travel sickness, car sickness, anything like that. Digestion is really great. So we always travel with this oil because you're eating at new restaurants. You don't know how things are going to settle. Or if you're flying on a plane or in the car and you get a little travel sick, this is a really, really great oil to have. It, like really quick results with this too. Like if I'm feeling any discomfort, I take this internally and apply a little bit on my tummy. And within five to 10 minutes, we are good to go. So it's a really nice to have these tools on hand that work so quickly. And last but not least is On Guard. This is the protective blend. This is amazing. We love this oil. We say it smells like Christmas and it cleans like bleach. So this is a blend of clove and cinnamon and wild orange and rosemary. It just smells so good, especially as we go into fall and winter time. One, it just smells awesome to make your house smell really good. I had some trick-or-treaters come to our house last year and you kids will tell you the truth, right? And we opened the door for them and this little boy said, your house smells so good. What is that? And we were diffusing on guard. So we love this blend, but more than just a great smell, right? Because there's a lot of room sprays and plugins and things. This is actually boosting our immune system. And I attribute this to my husband and I having such a strong immune system and why we don't feel under the weather very often. It's very rare that we may feel under the weather, which is so great. So nice to have these tools. And great for surface cleaners, great for pathogens or bugs in our life. If you have a scratchy throat, actually we were traveling at a family reunion and my husband started not feeling so great and getting a scratchy throat. So we had On Guard and Lemon and we just did a drop or two of each in a glass of water and he drank that within five minutes. He was good to go and that was gone. So again, so nice to have things that work quickly when we need them on hand to support us. And this also has clove in it. Clove has a numbing agent. So any type of jaw discomfort, tooth discomfort, or even if you were out and about and maybe you're having aches or discomfort in, in your joints or something, you could put that on topically too. So I love that the oils can work in many ways for us and work synergistically with that. So those are the top 10. About 80% of our health and wellness needs can be taken care of with one of these oils in the top 10. Whitney, did I miss anything? Anything that you want to add? Um, no, I was just going to share um, kind of a testimony that, um, that I have. I, have. I went to the doctor about a month ago, and it required me to get some labs done. And for those of you who know me, you know that's like a big no for me. I don't like needles. I've been terrified them, of them forever. But this time I went with my oils ready and I actually made a roller blend of On Guard and Wintergreen. And I rolled it on my arm before they took my blood. And I had told the woman, you know, I put something on my arm. So, you know, you might have to wipe it off. And she wiped it off and she took my labs. And honestly, I didn't even feel it. When we were finished, I was just blown away because these oils are amazing and they have just supported me so much. Oh my gosh. I love that, Whitney. I love that so much. All the things. My husband is the same way. He actually would pass out when people would take his blood. He was just so fearful of that. And what we started doing was um, lavender he would just smell it. We'd put a little bit on, he could smell it and it would just calm. And I love your tip. We're going to have to start doing that too, to right numb the area and take away the discomfort. That is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Thank you for sharing that. Yes, of course. 
All right. Well, if you guys have questions watching us, we've got several over on Facebook Live. Comment below. We'd love to help and support you answer any questions that you may have. And while I'm waiting for those questions to come in, what I'll do is briefly talk to you a little bit about how to get started with the oils how to get those in your home because I can provide, Whitney and I can provide all of the education and knowledge about the oils, but if we're actually not taking action and implementing those things into our daily life, you're not gonna see the results, you're not gonna see change. So similar to just like taking our supplements every day or our nutrition, the oils work best for us when we're using them regularly. Especially, most people come to oils reactively, right? They're under the weather, they don't feel good, something happened. But I really encourage people to use the oils proactively to support them with whatever is going on to kind of help with that health and wellness and be able to have that on hand so that we aren't feeling under the weather and fall. And that's where using the on guard, applying it to the bottoms of your feet every day or diffusing on guard or having those tools is really, really helpful to support us when we need it and have these natural tools. So I'm going to share my screen really quickly with you guys again. And we actually have two starter kits. These are the most, it's actually the most popular way to get started with doTERRA. And when you bundle, you save. And these are the exact oils that we talked about, the top 10 oils. So about 80% of our health and wellness concerns can be taken care of with one of these oils. This is the small kit. We have a little kit and a big kit. The small kit's 150 all of the top 10 oils that you have on hand, and it even has some beadlets. So these are like little breath fresheners, if you will. So we have On Guard and Peppermint. On Guard you can take to boost your immune system, or if you're feeling like you're coming under the, getting under the weather, anything like that. Peppermint, great for head tension, great for energy, great for digestive support. It just makes it easy for a quick way to take them internally, so I love to travel with these. This is 150. These are the little bottles. So there's about 80 to 85 drops in each bottle with this and a five ml bottle. And then this is the big kit. The big kit, there is 15 ml bottles here. So there's about 250 drops. So for less than double the price, you actually get two thirds more oil with the bigger kit. Also comes with a diffuser. This is the diffuser right here exact same diffuser. I've actually had this diffuser for two and a half years. <laughs> it has lasted me a really long time that we use it here. And I really love diffusers. I feel like you can't fully utilize your oils without a diffuser to really have that respiratory support, emotional support and cleansing and purifying in your home, which is so nice. So to give you an idea, this diffuser retail is around $63. A full size bottle of frankincense retails around $93. So that's why I can guarantee you if you're looking at oils at the mall or the health food store and you can find frankincense for $10, I guarantee you that is an adulterated oil. <laughs> guarantee you there. So the fact that this is all bundled is really great. And then just this month, doTERRA has a really cool special where if you get the bigger kit, you actually get two oils for free. This is Litsia and Manuka Touch. And Litsia is, these are two from Australia and New Zealand. You can't purchase them in the United States. So this is cool that they're throwing them in for free with the bigger kit. Litsia is a really great oil to boost antioxidant support. So this is very, very nice for, I kind of think of Litsia is similar to frankincense where it works on several different systems of the body. So you could actually add a drop to your water to just support you going into fall and winter. Amazing for the skin. And then there's an emotional piece to all the oils. We didn't really go into that. We're keeping this class basic, basics, but we like to expand on all of those. There's so much to learn. So we're just giving you a little taste of essential oils, but Litsia emotionally is the oil of manifestation, which I think is really beautiful. And then Manuka Touch, you guys may have heard of Manuka. Manuka honey. And you can actually Google Manuka honey and pull up. There's so many amazing health benefits of Manuka honey, which got them thinking, Hey, I wonder if there's more health benefits with Manuka plants, the Manuka tree there are with the Manuka essential oils. So I encourage you to Google. There's tons of research on essential oils on PubMed that you can use, but this is a really, really incredible one to have on hand to use. So this you could use as a perfume because it's already diluted as a roller, so you can just roll that right on. If you were to do one thing for your health and wellness, women, it's get rid of the perfumes. 
get rid of the synthetic fragrances. They're not serving us. They're actually being harmful to our fertility and our hormones and all of those things. So you can use this as a perfume. You can use it for skin support and also for immune support. So I feel like this is a power pack punch to go into fall and winter to have these two oils and we can't even buy them. So this is awesome that you can get them with the bigger kit. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us. If you heard about this class through Whitney, reach out to her. I know she would love to help and support you. This replay will be up for 48 hours in this group. So you can watch it again if you wanted to, or if you have any friends or family, if you have anybody that is having trouble with sleep or digestive support or respiratory support or emotional support, people that need these tools in their life, maybe they're dealing with a lot of aches or discomfort, please share. We have a passion. I know Whitney and I do. Our heart really goes into this. I get messages from people every day about how these oils are changing their life. A little bit about my background and story. So I was actually diagnosed with an extremely rare sarcoma in 2011. And I was in my 20s diagnosed with cancer. And that was a really scary time for me. And it caused me to look into what I was doing. And I literally detoxified my life, like changed my career as a physical therapist, start changing my diet, changing, getting rid of the chemicals, the toxins, the endocrine disruptors in our home. And that's what brought me to essential oils was I was like, wow, there, these are these tools and they can help me. They can support me emotionally while I was going through that journey, even detoxifying negative people, right? It all had to go. <laughs> and people ask me, how did you heal? And I said, I literally changed my life, everything. And I get messages every day from people about how these oils are changing their life. So we have a little special, we've got a special little welcome packet and goodies for anybody as a thank you for being here in this class. So that is just for 48 hours too. So reach out to us. We would love to help and support and serve if we can support people. Honestly, for me, I wish I would have known about these sooner. I really do. I wish that somebody would have shared this with me or that I would have had these tools sooner. And that's a passion of mine and why we show up and why we teach and why we educate and why we share. And we actually have a private Facebook group just for our oils family that we do regular education and support. This is just a little piece. So when your oils come in, we will actually, Whitney or I will actually schedule a call with you, a virtual call where we will go everything one-on-one. -on -one. We will teach you how to make rollers, how to dilute your oils, all of the things. The one thing I, that's not going to happen is your oils are not going to sit in a box. We're going to make sure that you feel confident and safe using your oils. And then we plug you into our Facebook group for continued education and support. There's a lot of people out there selling a product, but not as many people out there supporting people one-on-one -on -one and educating and empowering people. And that's what we do. As an example, I just taught a class Friday on essential oils for aches and discomfort and what to do if you're hurting. So we provide all that continued support there. So Winnie, anything else before we we kick it off and say goodbye? Um, I don't think so. Just um, thanks to everybody that joined and reach out to us if you have any questions or want to get started. Yes, we'd love to help you and support you. Thank you for being here and taking this time out of your Sunday afternoon to be here. And the replay will be up for 48 hours. Have a wonderful rest of your day, guys. Bye. Bye.